Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Skyrim. Alright, when we left off, we had uh, just brought... Well, that wasn't on camera, but we had just got Ulfgard. Want to hear a little north Ulfgard, wisdom? Part of the uh, whole team. And now she's the steward of this home. So uh, we already have her getting all the furnishings done and whatnot. So, we just simply have to wait for them to be brought into the house. Now, what we were going to do at the end of the last episode, but I ended up going over time, was going back to Lakeview and seeing how Lucia is adapting to her new home. Oh, my tears squeaking a little bit. Sorry about that. Trolls regenerate health when wounded, but are susceptible to fire. Susceptible. I don't know why I couldn't pronounce that right. It's an easy word. Blocking with a shield or weapon will recoil an attack and stagger the attacker. That is. That's some ugly ass teeth. I don't know what you're trying to do with that, man. It's not gonna help. Not even a little. Alright. Now we simply have to head inside, but first I want to clear these planters. Because we got them growing at the uh, other house now. So we'll just clear the poisonous ones out of here. And we'll get some of the uh, more important ones growing here. Like tomatoes and whatnot. If I can. I, I don't think I have any tomatoes on me. That's weird. Hmm. Anyway, we'll grow more leeks here, I think. Because we always tend to run out of those. And we'll get, I think, some sort of other food here. Maybe cabbage. Yeah, I think that'll work. And then some potatoes. And I think if I can get this going. Yeah, I do have lavender. Cool. We'll get this going again. There we go. I think we are all good now. Yeah, we're pretty much all good. Yeah, alrighty then. Cool beans. Now we'll head inside. And we'll see how Lucia is adapting to her new home. Sometime today, we're going to load into there. There it goes. All right. And she's going to be coming running out to me. There you are, Lucia. It's it's everything I could have hoped for. I'm glad to hear it. I I know it's not much, but I found a few pretty things. They're in the chest in my room. Aww. If you see anything you like, please take it. You've done so much for me. It's it's the least I can do. Oh. She's so cute. Okay, let's... Oop. Nah, there's nothing in there right now. So, we'll call that... You know, it's all good. It's all good. We don't need to worry about it. And, yeah, I think we have... Pretty much all the good things established. Yeah, we're good. We are good. Let's see... What I can drop. Because I'm carrying a lot... I'm carrying a lot of vampire stuff, mainly. Uh... Huh. I kinda wanna... Kinda sorta wanna... Huh. I think... I think... Hmm. Yeah, we'll do this. Although, I kind of want to get a, uh, hmm. Only 12? What? What? I'm, like, sitting on 10 here. What? What? I'm pretty sure I'm sitting on full enchanting stuff here. That is weird. Hmm. 
Well, almost full, but... Yeah, that is weird. Hmm. Oh, well. Uh, I guess I'll enchant that necklace here. With the thing I wanted to enchant it with. Yeah. And we'll do black soul gem for that. And... Huh. That is really weird. Don't know what's up with that. And we'll... Yeah, that's up to 20%. That should be relatively higher. Huh. I don't know. I don't know anymore. Hmm. Oh, well. Honored to see you again, my thing. Yes, Lydia. I know you are. You always are. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's drop some of these things off. Let's drop that and that and that. One of these. That. And I'll put this. And I'll sell that later. And these I'm going to be making better for Serana later. Is there anything else I can drop? Because I still have a lot of weight on me. For some reason. Is it food, mainly? Is it food? Uh... Kinda. I mean, I have butter for some reason. Don't know where I picked up butter. Uh, beef stew. Yeah, we'll put that there. Hmm. It's horker meat. That's what's putting me over. And what I needed for that was lavender. That's what I needed for a horker stew. There we go. And... Do some venison stew. There we go. And I'll put the horker... The horker meat away. There we go. And we'll deal with these. Red apples. We don't really need as many as those. There we go. Yeah, and I did have tomatoes, so I can't grow them. All right. I'm learning things. I'm learning things as I go along. More or less. <laughs> and we'll put the elixir away so I don't accidentally down it because I'm an idiot. I will be an idiot and accidentally down it. I guarantee it. And yep, there we go. All good there. And I think it's about as good as it's going to get. Or right now. Let me look. Yeah, that's about as good as it's gonna get. Um. Okay. We'll call that good. Let's see if we can make a few things in the alchemy area. There we go. Fortify health. And then. Oh, yeah, I could mix those together, huh? I completely forgot. Um, yeah, we'll use those up. And, yeah, I think that's it. We'll just call that good for now. And we'll get the hell out of here, and we'll go on to dealing with the Moth Priest with Serana like I had planned. The Blades have long since disbanded, and the organization's few remaining members have gone into hiding. The Emperor is now protected by a special security force. The Pentilus Oculatus, I think. I didn't quite read it quickly enough. <laughs> uh, you know. I'm half asleep. <laughs> the horses of Skyrim are hardy and strong, and make up for endurance with their lack in speed. God, that helmet looks cool, though. It does. Oh, I thought that was a uh, bandit there for a second. I'm like, whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> anyway. We are all good here. And now we will go back to the Dawn Guard and pick up Serrano once again. Whoopsie. Uh, remove it. There we go. I accidentally. In my haste, I was pressing buttons that I should not have been pressing. <laughs> 
Tamriel's Fighters Guild has no presence in Skyrim. Instead, warriors seeking adventure and kinship may join the Companions in Whiterun. Well, you know, that's how it goes. Huh. <sighs> Daedric princes are godlike beings that inhabit a pair. She's probably inside, as of right now. And... I'll have to look around to find her, probably. <sighs> anyway. Or she might actually be in the first little circular area that you come into. She might just be sitting on a wall's ledge or something. I don't know. Like, over here? Nope. Or here? Yeah! There she is. Zorana. Are you looking for me? Yeah, I was. You still want to come with me? Of course. Let's go. Whoa. That was a little forceful. Of course. Let's go. <laughs> Alright. I'm a little weird. Okay. I think we're going to look for Serene real quick. And then get some of those quests started. Ugh. For some reason, my mouth was not wanting to form the word. It's a lot. It's Dirac. Where is Serene? God damn it. It's Gunmar. Motherfucker. Father mucker, motherfucker. She's probably over here, isn't she? God damn it. Serene! There you are. God damn it. Hope you're getting along with Isron. I like what Isran has done with the place. Can you teach me how to make a crossbow? Someone else, a basic one. Yeah. Of course. That is assuming you know anything about steel smithing. It's pretty simple. Fair enough. Talk to Gunmar if you need materials. Hmm. Uh. What can I do to help? I want to add some punch to our crossbow capabilities. Done all I can on my own. Ah, there we go. Need a little inspiration. Stony Creek I've Cave. I've always been fascinated with Dwemer artifacts. I take them apart, poke around in their guts, and try to figure things out. It makes results. Well, that's how it goes sometimes. But as luck would have it, I've tracked down the location of some actual Dwemer diagram drawings. Awesome. So, if you'd be a deer and collect those plans for me? Of course. I'll do that. As long as you teach me how to use them after. Or how to make them. Yep, I'll take these. Because they're always good to have. There we go. Is there anything else? Nope. Nothing else I can gather, so we will go along on our merry way. And Stony Creek Cave. Do I have that unlocked? I'm pretty sure I do. Stony Creek Cave. Uh, no, I do not. But I'm pretty close. Hmm. Okay. God, there's so many things I still need to do. And I, they're flooding my brain right now. Those with the blood of a werewolf can never gain resting bonuses from sleeping. Ooh. That was a weird music change. <laughs> dun, dun. Okay. Alright. Let's, uh... Get the help an orc to be able to go up there and get the ebony. But we're not necessarily at a point where we can use the ebony yet. So... That mm, kind of screws us a little bit. Uh, we'll go do the crossbow thing just to get that done. And then we will go deal with the moth priest. Because the Moth Priest thing will take a while, I think, if I remember right. Yeah, it, it will take a little bit of a while. It'll probably take a whole episode. So we'll deal with this right now. And get that done and over with. Yep. And we need to do... Oh, uh, first I have to have it marked as a quest. That helps a little bit. And we'll take a bit of this iron here. Because why the fuck not, right? Iron's always good, especially if you're making multiple houses. 
Which is what I do all the fucking time. It's so bright out here. I don't know how you stand it. Being immortal, that helps a little bit. And it's over there. Okay, so we have to go this way. Through that... Uh, giant's camp. Great. Okay. Um... This might take a little more time than I thought. I thought I had that all unequipped. Well shite. Okay. And Steam Crag Camp. Uh, let's just avoid them for now. We don't really need to trifle with them right now. I'm sure I'll uh, need to fight them in a little bit, but not right now. Not necessary right now. There we go. We've got some flowers. So pretty. And they're all the way over here. Okay. Cannot wait until I get the heavy armor perk that lets me run without being weighed down by this freaking armor. Good lord. Saps my stamina so quickly. Good lord. Alright. So are you right behind me, Serana? Uh, of course you're not. What the? What? God. God damn it. More dragons? Are you kidding me? distracted by things other than me. It's annoying. Okay. Let's see if we can get Dragon Rend on it. Yep. Now it's coming to me. Jesus. Come on, Dragon. Get over here so I can fight you. Son of a bitch. Oh, it's just a purely regular dragon. Come on, man. Okay. Serana, where'd you go? Oh, you're over there. Okay. Why are you, why are you fighting over there? Why was I crouching? That was weird. What on earth are you fighting over here? God damn dragons. Running all over the place. No sense to them. Okay, that didn't work. But it was over here. Whatever it was is clearly dead. Whoop, there it is. There's the dragon. Okay. Well, this is a good deal. Fledgling with 
Potion of the Warrior. What? Weirdos. Oh, you you had risen one of the wolves. Okay, I was about to say, what the hell? We're gonna attack my wolves now? Jeez. That was a uh, hell of a fight. <laughs> we didn't even end up getting there. <laughs> All right. Well, that's a thing. Take that, and we'll head all the way up there. Wait. Which one's which? This one. It's this one. Okay. Alright. I thought it was that one for a bit there. It's like, no. It's just the angle making the thing look like that. Hey, fox. Doing fox. This is this place that we needed to go. Stony Creek Cave. And we will delve into this cave in the next episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're currently playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one, the only, Stray Cat, playing games for you.